never tried ballet core before so i wanted to try it out i didn't want to go out and buy a ton of new stuff but i did really want to try out this style so i put together some outfits with just some basic clothing pieces that i had already i feel like most people at least have some of these items so if you're wanting to try out this style hopefully this video inspires you and gives you some ideas of how you can style different pieces that you already own in all of these outfits i'm wearing the same bralette it's from cotton on their stuff is pretty pricey but i bought this one for like a two for one sale this first outfit is a black based outfit i have these knee high socks that i scrunched down to give off like a leg warmer effect i'm just wearing these nike sneakers there's no particular reason why i chose these because they have nothing to do with ballet they're just sneakers i have this very pretty sage colored vest the vest is from h&m i wore some biker shorts and then this square neck black top the top I got from Sheen and the bottoms I got from Cotton On. I wore this big black bow and I'm wearing these dainty little earrings from Primark. To throw in another color, I wore these periwinkle leggings that I got from Fabletics. And since I changed my leggings, I made another outfit just by taking off the vest and having my black top with my leggings. I have the same little earrings on. I just put my hair in a ponytail with this fluffy scrunchie. Now we're going into the next outfit. So I grabbed this sweater that I got from Forever 21. Instead of just wearing it normally, I took off the top button and then put my arms through and then I tucked it in in the back and it just made this cute little jacket thing. I have no idea what they're called. I changed from black to white socks. These are actually my fiance's Nike socks. He gave them to me because I like them and they're comfy but they're long so again i just scrunched them down to give like the leg warmer effect but i took off the sweater and i changed it to this short sleeve little throw on bow tie top that's also from forever 21 and i changed from the black bow to this pink bow i don't think i got an up close shot of it here but i think i do show it later i completely changed my outfit here I put on this new bow that I got from Sheen. I bought a crap ton of accessories from Sheen forever ago, so I have a ton of bows from there. I'm wearing this white mid-sleeved top. I used to do ballet forever ago, and I had a leotard like that, so it just reminds me of that. This top is from Korea, just like from street shopping in Korea. This skirt also, I got street shopping in Korea. It's just a black wrap skirt. The wrap skirt with like the little bow is very ballet inspired, but I think if you have any sort of flowy skirt, it doesn't need to be a wrap skirt. It doesn't need to have a bow on it. It can also give off the same vibes. With this outfit, I wore these ballet flats. I got these from Target. I have been in love with this pair of ballet flats. Instead of like the typical rounded like oval edge, it's a bit more boxy, but the ones that I was obsessed with were like 120 bucks, but I found these at Target for $19. And they they're essentially the same thing. These next two outfits, I just played off the idea of pastels and bows. I thrifted this dress and it's just a super pretty, flowy, light blue dress. I'm wearing all the same exact thing for this one, but I just changed the dress. It also has these little bow ties at the shoulder. I thrifted this one as well. Again, just playing off the idea of pastels, light colors. They just remind me of spring. It's just super feminine, super soft. Here, I'm showing the pink bow that I also got on Sheen that I wore earlier in one of my other outfits. This dress is from H&M. I love the neckline. It's also just a nice, feminine, dainty little dress. I started going back to like that black theme. I am wearing a pink sweater in this one and it's got two little parts so you can tie a little bow. This skirt I got from Forever 21. I put the black bow back on. I put on these lace black socks and I'm just wearing my ballet flats again. For this next outfit, I changed the sweater. I got this sweater from Zara. With this outfit and a couple of the other ones where you can really see the bralette because it's crossed in the back, I love the way that it comes right up close to the neck and then just the angle that it comes forward. This next one, I'm wearing this sweater from Old Navy. If you have any sweaters and tops that come down in like a V or a square neck, really just any like open neck, those are the types of sweaters that will give you more of that ballet core look. I paired this with some black leggings. I also got these from Fabletics. Here's another pair of earrings. They're just gold with a little pearl at the bottom. And I switched back to this bow that I was wearing earlier. 
With this outfit, I just wore my ballet flats again. And for this last outfit, I also kept the same ballet flats. I changed the sweater, and here I'm doing the same thing. I put it on, and then I left the first button alone, but the second and third buttons I buttoned together in the back, and it was super long in the back, so I tucked it in. Well, that is it for my ballet-inspired outfits. I hope they were inspiring for you if you're wanting to try out this style. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!